Well, hello there, survivors. And welcome. Welcome to Staxel. Pull up a chair. Or a stump. Or a root. And help me build, maybe. If you can guide me, that would be very nice. I'm not much of a builder, as you know. So I need all the help I can get. <laughs> this, by the way, is Staxel. And you can pick it up at playstaxel.com. It is currently in pre-alpha. Uh, so it's in early, very early development. And it's available for five bucks for Windows. I think it's Windows only at the time being. But my guess is it will be available for other platforms as well when, when that happens. Again, right now it's super early pre-alpha. And the game is obviously not complete. And there will be bugs, etc. if you do decide to give it a try. Did I mention it's five dollars? That's it. Five bucks. Check it out. So I wanted to share this with you. This is a game that I've had my eye on for quite some time. It's being developed by an acquaintance of mine that I met through uh, Starbound. As he was a, uh, he worked on Starbound in some capacity. I'm not exactly sure what, but he's now working on this game. Oops, I don't want that. I want to keep some of this natural um, root or stump here as sort of a bar or a table. Yeah, that's fine. So let's get rid of that then. Whoops, get my shovel out. So again, I'm just going to show you a little bit of the creative mode here. There's all sorts of stuff to play around with. We have building blocks. We have um, props that are obviously prefabricated. And we could just choose them and plop them down. My guess is eventually all of this will have to be crafted. The game is going to be, in the long run, some sort of a sandbox RPG game. With exp exploration and discovery and farming. Uh, there's going to be dungeons you can explore and find rare exotic goods. I don't know if there's going to be any sort of monsters in the game or not. But, again, I'll put a link down below and you guys can follow up on that on your own. And do your own due diligence and read about it at the website. Let's, um, let's, let's build up some walls here. Thinking about... Let's expand it out a little bit more here put these floors in. So there's all kinds of blocks to play around with. And I don't really know which ones... And I'm not very familiar with them. I'm just kind of futzing around right now. I think I have to clear these guys out to build over them. But maybe not. Let's try. Oh. Yeah, I guess I have to eliminate these flowers first. All right, there we go. I've got my deck with natural root table. Let's put some chairs here. Um, do we have any smaller chairs? I see like a bench. I suppose that'll have to do. And maybe we could put like a potted plant on it, like a little flower. I'll spruce it up a little bit. Sure. Can I plop that right up on top? Oh my gosh. All right, no. Oh no, that's giant. Let's put that over here instead, on the corner. Can I do that? Oh, neat. Yeah. Oh, lovely. Sunflowers. Now, hold up a sec. I think we can rotate these. This is the sun. I think the sun rises over there. So let's um, put it down. Oh, you can rotate. But I don't want them looking that way. I want them looking this way. There we go. Yeah, so apparently they face the sun. And ooh, I had you right the first time, huh? Okay. Now that's going to have to go. We're not gonna, we need space to eat. <laughs> All right. Lovely. Uh, let's get some... There are no smaller chairs, huh? Like I said, it's an early access game, so things will change. Things will be added. And yeah, we're just going to have to live with what we got here. Let's just put the bench... Um, let's do this. Make that just a little smaller. Oh, you know what? We need light, don't we? Tell you what. Let's put a light up. Easy as pie. And this you can also rotate. Basically, you hold down your mouse button, your left mouse button, and then re and right mouse button to rotate it, and then release to put it down. Let's put two. There we go. And, oh! 
Okay, we have power. Awesome. Now, uh, let's just fill that little gap in right there, shall we? And I think I have to dig it down first. So the building is rather intuitive and quite easy to do, and you can even fill in these little holes like that. I love it. Great. That looks fantastic. And I think I might even... No, hold on. Let's go back one more. Yeah, suddenly my um, my natural banquet table is now nothing more than a, like a stool. But whatever. Still there. And I think I'm going to put that bench back. There's me bench. Perfect. Yeah, I like that. Very nice. So one thing I love about games like this is the props. Like, I'm not much of, a, of, a, of an architect, like building a, a standing structure, a home. You know, I can make basic places. And I'm happy with small. I like simple. Small and simple. Like my little cozy cottage that I used to make. Um, but I do love props, and I could, I could spend hours upon hours just doing props. And I think that's where this game is really going to shine. Just based on what I've seen so far in creative mode. Let's just chop that away a little bit. And I think I'm going to have my floor go all the way around. And I'm going to put... Can I chop right through? I wonder what that will leave behind. I'd love to have like a little door. Oh, no. It's not going to work, is it? No, it's not. But I can have a window. <laughs> If I do that, the whole thing's going to come tumbling down, probably, right? All right, well, I'll fix that later. Let's, um... Let me make the decking all the way around. I love how it just contours itself around this tree. See that? And we can fill in those tiny little gaps. Uh, my, my guess is I can remove that and then fill that in, too. Whoops. Oh, I don't want to do that. I want to do that. See, that's so neat. There we go. That makes it easy on me. Just has a mind of its own. Seems to know what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Alright. Not too shabby. So we have a little deck. And now I need to build, like place to sleep. Let's get rid of this. Might use that as a, a walk up. Yeah, that's cool. Let's see if I can fix this. Yes, I can. How lovely is that? But you know what? I like that going through. Okay, still messing with props. I know I need to make a, a house. And I want to make a house, but these props are just way too much fun. <laughs> I'm not sure I like the look of that. Let's try this other little bush here with the flowers. Yeah. I think that looks better. All right, just squeeze you right in there, little feller. Awesome. Okay. Now, so I've got the deck going all the way around, and I love that I have this, um, this hole going through the tree. That's kind of neat. You can see through the other side. I fixed up that busted uh, tree trunk. I found the right wood for it, so that's nice. And now I think... Ooh, what's that? Oh. Oh, okay. Stop with the props. Stop with the props. <laughs> Let's make, um, I need to make a place where I can sleep. So, let's see. Should we put it in the back over here? And put it on the side. Okay, let's get the walls up. How big are these walls? These look kind of nice. So, as I said earlier, small is fine for me. I like a little place. Just want to make sure I can get a door in here. Um, hold on, let's knock those down. It's going to be way back here. Oops. So I don't know if I mentioned it, but the game will support multiplayer. So you'll be able to log on to other people's servers, most likely, and uh, play together. And build up little towns. And have some, uh, some co-op and multiplayer fun. So I'm really looking forward to that. Okay, guys, I found some lovely fuchsia carpeting. 
And I'm putting that in my bedroom. Oh, so soft. That's gonna feel much better than that cold, hard wood flooring on my toes when I wake up in the morning. Let's put a window in, shall we? Let's get rid of that. Plop. And I think this window is pretty big, so we're gonna need more space than that. And where is it? There it is. Already made up. So I think, like I said earlier, we're probably gonna have to um, craft these things eventually. Go out and find ingredients and do some collecting out in the world and then come back and craft them up. But of course, right now, this is all creative mode, so it's a snap. Now, this is going to be a little tight getting through here. I might have to pop this out a little bit, huh? No problem. Whoop! Wrong thing. So let's expand the deck. Or the flooring, anyway. Okay, guys. Almost done. Let me throw a window in here. And I'll turn that around a little bit. How about we put it right there? And then fill in that gap with this wood. And I think... Oop. Nope, nope, nope. A little bit more. A little more. There we go. Oh, it's pretty swell. It's kind of squarish. And I'm probably going to move something up there around. Maybe bring those lights out a little bit more. And maybe extend the overhang. Just a tad. Uh... I know this, there might be some other roofing materials, but this is in my hot bar. Might as well use it. Yeah, so I'll probably extend this all the way out. Might have to move those lights clearly. But uh, it's coming along. Ooh. Oh, that's beautiful. Let's just bring the lights down a little bit so we can see them. Put them right here. Oh, no, no, no. A little higher. A little higher. A little higher. And we should be good to go. There we go. Or maybe somebody will turn those on in a sec. So, welcome to my humble abode. Need some lights inside too. I can't see a darn thing. We're gonna need another window maybe across here. Oh, hi. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Put a window here. We actually have one other style of window, but I'm only gonna use the one right now. Okay, that light's on. Excellent. Yeah, we'll put another light up here. I think there's only this one style of light right now as well. It's just gonna have to do. Uh, I need a bed. I need a bed. What's going on here? Let's get rid of that. So we got a little wonkiness here, but again, it's a uh, pre-alpha, so not everything's gonna work smoothly, is it? No. Okay, so we're getting a little bit of a issue there in the corner in the corner there too but not gonna worry about that let's get let's get a bed in here and i'm gonna have to redo all this floor too uh oh darn let's just do it right now <laughs> i want my toes to be warm when i wake up right that's what i said all right let's get a bed in shall we how about uh, a good old red bed minecraft red although Hmm. Wow, that's a tight fit, isn't it? That's okay, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it's a little tight fit. Oh, there's my shovel. I dropped it. How do I pick it up? Oh, I don't know. Come here, shovel. It's floating in the air. Oh, cool. Can I get another one? I think I can just summon another shovel. Um, shovel? Yeah, there we go. Fine. Be that way. I don't need you anyway. Okay, well, that's um, it's a little tight, but it's also cozy. And like I said, that's what I like. I like cozy cottages. Now, I'm wondering if we need like a little railing here, or maybe some more potted plants around the edges. Uh, there's lots of decorating we can do, and how come you guys are all cockeyed like that? Did I do that? I did not even notice. You know, we could even eliminate some of this tree here. Hopefully it won't fall down on us, but I kind of like that. What about you guys? It's got like a little natural table here built built right in from the tree trunk. Yeah. Very cool. And I think there might even be like a... Um, let me see. What do we have here for like a bureau? All right, guys. I've got to quit. I'll spend all day working on these stinking props. I could. There's so many of them and it's so fun. 
but uh, I got to call it quits. So I got some things to do here. So I just wanted to share this game with you. I hope you all um, enjoyed. And again, it's Staxel is the name of the game. And you can get it at playstaxel.com. I'll put a link down below. It's $5 right now during the development stages. It's a pre-alpha. And uh, it's available for Windows right now at the time being. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, a like is appreciated on the video. And let me know if you want to see more. So with that, I bid you adieu. Goodbye for now.